Hey everybody, I'm back. And today what we're going to do is we're going to do something from my past, which is explore different cultures. We're going to get cultured. And that's literally what this is. We're going to make chicken pho. What in the world is chicken pho? Well, it's a Vietnamese soup. So I contacted Get Cultured Box. They sent me this and uh, came in a real cool bag. And you've got all your stuff. You've got your spice bag, your sides, your noodles, fish sauce, and you've got your instructions and the story of the company, which I really like because the woman that founded this company, it all goes back to family. It's all a story and it all talks about it and I'm going to put a picture of that up on the video. But let's get started. So real easy uh, meal prep. We're going to do it. I'm going to use the Instapot. What we're going to do is I got some chicken. Now, it calls for a whole chicken. I'm not going to lie to you. I didn't have one. I'm still digging out the freezer and everything, but we didn't have one. So what we're going to do is I've got four quarts of water in here. I'm going to cut open this bag. And we've got boneless, skinless thighs, which is what we're going to use. Well, what would I use? I would use a full chicken. So, we're going to just dump that in there, and and I'll be right back. Alright, so, what we're going to do... We're going to open up our kit, and this is really cool, it, it says DIY Faux Kit. Now, um, we've got the noodles, which so I've got the spice bag. It's like making tea. Now, if anybody paid attention, I made beef pho last time, so I had a half bottle of fish sauce left over. And we're going to add that. You add about a half bottle, you might want to add more, but And I gotta tell you how awesome this company is. I I posted a question the other day. I I messaged them and said, "Look, um, what do I do if I want to use the Instapot?" Well, because the Instapot directions aren't necessarily on here. Um, so what it says is you do the 20 minutes. Um, on the stew setting and forget it. So while we're waiting for this, I'm going to boil these noodles in water for about five to seven minutes. You've seen me boil noodles. I'm sure you know how to do it. I'm not going to show you. So we're going to boil some noodles. Um, the other thing we're going to our garnishes. We've got an onion, we've got some cilantro, we've got some green onion. I'm going to chop that up. We're going to make that into our garnishes and I'm going to show you how to do this because this is really cool. It's real simple, it's soup, it's multicultural and that's what it's all about. Food brings people together. All right. So the mad scientist has done his work. What I did was I 
instapotted the uh, chicken. I cut it up and um, I'm going to give you a little trick and I can't take uh, responsibility for this. This is all Stacy's doing. So the kit calls for you to cook the noodles up separately. Well, I cooked them up and they became this big gelatinous, you know, starchy blob. And I'm like, oh crap, what do I do? So Stacy recommended that I put this back in the hot broth and that worked out great. So this is a wonderful thing for your, you know, you get the kids involved, you get everybody involved and, and you make it yourself. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to take a little scoop of chicken, you know, um, yeah, why not? And you grab some green onions. You grab some sliced onion. You break it up. And you grab some cilantro. What I really love to do is use um, Thai basil, which I grow. Um, I don't have any right now because it's January, but it's a good flavorful basil to try. Then we're gonna put some of our noodles and broth. You know, and then what you do is you get a bunch of broth. You get a little bit more broth and Boy, I wish we had smell-o-vision right now because it's you can really smell that in Nice. And because I always go big or go home, I've got my huge spoon here. We're going to mix it up. And uh, Wow. Flavorful, fresh, made it at home, and it's an adventure. Give this a shot. Remember, be kind, be excellent to each other, and have a great day. I'll see you soon.